airlines are prepared to give your cat a secure environment to travel in. Although airlines and flight attendants are prepared to help you with your feline travel companion, you as a pet owner must be prepared to care of your cat's emotional and physical requirements. Number 1. Choose a comfortable cat carrier. You should have two different cat carriers in your home, one for trips to the vet and one for travel. If you use the same cat carrier for the vet's office every time, your cat will think that carrier with an undesirable destination. But having a second cat carrier may make your cat feel less anxious when it's time to fly. Always call the airline in advance to find out what kind of cat carrier or cage is permitted on the flight, as well as the airline's recommended pet carrier sizes. Number 2. Train your cat to like the carrier. The key to fly with your cat is preparation. It will take time to help your cat form positive associations with its cat carrier. Hence, start preparing your cat for the carrier many weeks in advance. The cat carrier will be considerably more cozy and appealing. If you put it in a warm location and add a soft blanket and your cat's favorite toy, Reward your cat every time he spends time in the carrier. Your cat will create positive associations with the carrier with the aid of high-value rewards. To get your cat used to traveling in the carrier, place your cat in the carrier for progressively longer periods of time and even take your cat on short trips in the car or even just for a drive around the neighborhood. Number 3. Try using pheromones to calm your cat. Pheromones can be used to lower the stress caused by unfamiliar surroundings and situations. You can use a synthetic pheromone that is similar to the real pheromone which the cat deposits when they rub against objects. Pheromones, when sprayed inside the cage, may give your cat the impression that he is in a safe and controlled environment. Number 4. Prepare for security checks. When you have to take your cat out of his carrier and hold him while going through security, it's one of the most crucial steps in the flying process. This exposes your cat to an open and unfamiliar environment, which can lead to anxiety. The best way to handle this is to swaddle the cat in a blanket so that he doesn't squirm free or claw at you. Most cats shouldn't have an issue with going back into the carrier afterwards because at this point, they feel as though this is their safe space. Number 5. Consider putting your cat in the cargo area. Most airlines provide space for pets in the cabin or the cargo area. Cats in the cabin may make some animal owners feel more comfortable, but that can actually is uncomfortable. Flying with your cat under the seat in front of you is not ideal, especially for longer flights. The space is too small and does not allow enough room for your cat to stand or sit. You shouldn't feel bad about being separated from your cat during the flight because airlines have designated sections in their cargo designed to keep cats secure. Also, this choice enables your cat to travel in a bigger carrier that can accommodate a tiny bed and a litter box. Coordinate with the airline ahead of time so that the company can make the appropriate arrangements for your cat. Thanks for watching.